there's some O snaps for 3D that have been added in, and let's go ahead and try some of those out. Just on a, we'll just quickly put something together here. Let's place a box on the screen and rotate it around. Then what we'll do is we'll go and place a cylinder. And I'm going to shift right click to find my snaps. And here's the new section here called 3D O snap. But I'm going to go to the center of a face. And I want to pick the face that I want. And you can see you can highlight when I move around to each face. So let's put this on the front face here. And now I'm going to go ahead and just simply just click and pull the cylinder out like that. Try one more time. We're going to go to, this time we're going to place a wedge. Shift right click. O snap. Midpoint on an edge. Pick an edge. Point. And lift up the, lift up the wedge. Like so. Now keep in mind these are still independent 3D objects. Solids. Not, this has not been fused together, so we're basically appending these onto the model that we have here. So when you shift right click, you can do that midstream, but you can uh, pull the, the snaps out as you see. There's perpendicular, nearest to the face, and so on. And these will allow you knots for you know 3D splines, vertex, and so on. You can choose these off this list by simply, again, using the shift right click to pull this up uh, very quickly on the screen.